minutes until sermon. Is everything taken care of? Yes, Your Holiness. One minute, people! You proofread the pamphlets? You polished the collection plates? Yes, Your Holiness. And refreshments for the crew? Enough wine and crackers to last us till supper. Magnifico. Ahem. <laughs> fa 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 fire. B -b -b brimstone. Brimstone. <laughs> Can we get a sound check? <laughs> Heavenly. Give him hell, sir. <laughs> and the Lord said, the fearful, the unbelieving, the sorcerers, and the idolaters shall have their part in the lake which burneth with fire and brimstone. Can I get an amen? I miss the rapture? Is this because of those orphans? Those whore orphans? The orphans? Uh, let's see. What's over here? Nothing over here. What about over here? Hello! Are you lost, my child? Come in, come in. Welcome to St. Peter's Basilica. Oh, hello. Come right in. Maybe we could find you a seat. Something in the front row, perhaps? Well, actually, I'm just... I know, lucky you. It's not every day one gets to meet the Pope. Actually, I could use some directions. Can you tell me where the Science Center is? The what? Oh, you know, the building where they talk about how the Earth was made, origins of life, natural disasters, that kind of stuff. Ah, you probably read about it. Blasphemy! Let me see that. Science. And more science! I thought the church stopped all this nonsense when we locked up Galileo. And since when do you serfs know how to read the written word? Oh, never mind. I can see the line from here. Do you think the super science friends are going to show up? The museum is being dedicated to them. I... I don't get it. What does science have that religion doesn't? Why, we've got Adam and Eve. We've got plagues, seven of them. And we've got Noah's Ark, too. You can't tell me they've got anything as good as Noah's Ark. Yeah, but that all seems a little far-fetched. Where's your proof any of it even happened? Why don't you go back in time and film it? That's what the super science friends would do. <laughs> Cardinals, I've just had some divine inspiration. <laughs> And it is for those reasons why I named him Schwanzi.
Thank you. Well, um, that was certainly informative. Darwin, I believe you're next. I was going to bring in one of my tortoises, but something uh, happened on the way here. So instead, I chose to share the pets that helped cement my reputation in the scientific community. They are various varieties of tanagers, but you probably know them as Darwin's finches. Ooh, can I hold one? It was these birds that gave me my first real clue about evolution. Notice the subtle differences in the beak, body size, and color. After observing this, I realized that all species must share these common bonds. And so I devised this handy diagram. I call it the Tree of Life. As a bit of a ribbing to those holy rollers in Rome. Look here, you can see that there are even more finches than the ones I brought in today. For example, the Tanager family, and, uh, hold on, where are they? My finches, they, there should be over a dozen birds right here. Hey, don't look at me. What, what is happening? No, 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 no. No, not the seals. No, not the lizards. Not the snakes. No, not the tortoises. Anything but the delicious tortoises! <laughs> no! <laughs> Let's go see what's up. <laughs> Am I gonna get to show off my pet gerbil or what? His name is Bernie. That's clear. I think there's something going on. Are they detecting any time anomalies? Hi. It's fine. It's not like I was doing anything anyways. Scanning. Seems not a Oh my god. Oh Jesus. That is not normal. That's that, oh. Tom. I'm here for you. Holy Davidettes! What the damn devil is going on in the Galapagos Islands? Super science friends, get to the science mobile! The anomaly is originating from 2000 BC. Unfortunately, because of the size of the anomaly, the closest to be able to get to it is about 30 miles off the coast. So, you are going to need something a little more seaworthy. Way ahead of you! Okay, for the 175th time, let's try to get this Noah's Ark thing right. You got that doohickey ready? This time, we're gonna try it. Lion, tiger, then hippo, then baby kangaroos, then elephants. Got it? You think you can manage that? Yes, your holiness. This time, I think we've got it. Oh, dang it to heck. How many times is it gonna take to get this right? Do we even have any lions left now? None, sir. Ugh. Well, at least the Romans won't be feeding any Christians to them in a couple thousand years. There was also a 19th century frigate sailing by in the background, so the shot was ruined anyway. What? Where? <gasps> Scientists! They've come to stop us from proving the validity of God's great and holy heavenly word. Seek Semper Tyrannus! 
Cardinals! Deus Volt! Battle Stations! Try and stop the will of Almighty God. It is His beautiful, glorious, godly, divine God will that this Ark save all the Earth's animals. You're literally killing all the Earth's animals. Uh... <laughs> what else is on this boat? As long as I was traveling through time proving the word of God, I figured I'd go ahead and correct a few things while I was at it. <laughs> you see, how can there be dinosaur fossils making people ask questions about evolution when the dinosaurs never went extinct? <laughs> Hmm? Nope. Stand aside, Beardo. I got this one. That's right. Come here, big boy. Whoa, whoa! Ow! Ow! Okay, okay, this was a mistake. Ow! God damn it. That's gonna be all kinds of bruised up tomorrow. And God said, I am going to bring floodwaters on the earth to destroy all life under the heavens. Everything on earth will perish! gonna call me? Okay, so you have magic god powers. You've proved your point, that's fine. You were right, we were wrong. How about you not drown all these animals? What kind of god would want you to do that? This is 2000 BC. That means this is Old Testament God. Super science friends, to have the knowledge that there is more in this universe than your pitiful science can explain! <laughs> if you love knowledge so much, then I've got a little piece of the Garden of Knowledge. I mean, the Garden of Eden, Tree of Knowledge for you, Snake in the Grass, Apple Grove! Religion zero. Take that. 
Please, sweet, beautiful, glorious Jesus, baby, come forth from your mangery heaven and aid your blessed servant. Guys in hell. <laughs> <laughs> To parent to child down through the age Our stories of Adam, Eve, Abel and Cain Yes, they ring so true in our childish minds But really should start once upon a time You say your mother left you and now you're out here looking for her well, yes, as a matter of fact, I have seen your mother. Why, she's just inside here. That's right. Come on, just follow me. Why, hello there, young man. Welcome to the Church of Teslaology. Would you care to have your AC levels audited? Tesla be with you. They've been wrong about every goddamn thing so far From the age of the world to the existence of dinosaurs Open your eyes wide if you wanna be brave And see evolution in 